Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Welcome to uh, Overview Episode 1, Nikon N65. Now, this is an amazing little camera. It feels very light, quite plasticky, uh, you know, it's, it's but uh, <laughs> it has a lot of surprises in store for anyone that buys this camera. It uh, was available, I'm pretty sure, in year in the year 2000. Uh, I think it came with a pretty swell lens, uh, a kit lens. Uh, maybe uh, something like a 20, 28 to 80 millimeter, 5.6, something like that. Uh, I may have one here, actually. But, uh, so here we go with the overview on this camera. This, uh, this camera will give you the same photos as an f5 something that was worth back then over two thousand dollars this three hundred dollar camera with lens as long as your lens is comparable will give you the same photos it had the same features as those cameras the autofocus feature the matrix metering features it uh you know so the value for the money was uh, quite amazing the uh you know it is what it is right so anyhow this uh this camera patrick hollands uh, this is one of the cameras he donated it takes uh two cr2 batteries so if you're looking for just uh you know it's got picture modes in it the, the, you know we'll go through a lot of the functions as we go on with the different episodes uh, so uh so here we go the, this uh it's you got to be careful with things right because it is quite uh, plastic -y. it has dx coding it, it's it's quite an amazing camera actually so uh because i've i took it out and shot it once already and i just couldn't believe it so this camera will run your autofocus uh g lenses with vibration reduction yes you heard me right this will run your vr g lenses <laughs> and it does <laughs> so you know <laughs> wow right it has, uh, it, I, I can't remember what the, uh, the flash sync speed, the flash sync speed is pretty low in it. It's got, it's got a, a small little pop-up flash on it. To, uh, if you're doing really wide angle stuff, you're probably going to be a little bit let down by the flash. It has an autofocus light, you know, real depth of field. Uh, actually look to it. Uh, the viewfinder is a bit small and not the clearest viewfinder in the world. The, the display the display is quite uh, quite a good display in it. I probably put the batteries in wrong. Let's see. Of course, quite a good display. There we go. So uh, when we put a lens on it and everything, all that will change. It. Uh, I don't know if we can get this to fire or not. Uh, there we go. Here we go nice and quiet uh, so for a travel lens or a uh or a travel camera or or just a light camera if you're a beginner and you just want to walk around and shoot photos and not have to worry about fiddling around with all the controls and stuff you, you have a full uh, full auto mode uh, the p mode program mode shutter priority aperture priority uh manual settings and all these different shooting modes the it's a uh, automatic rewind Jeez, you know this is a really good camera so uh you know i don't know what else uh i can tell you about this in this uh, quick uh, no mirror lockup that's for sure there's there's uh there's no mirror lockup on this uh, camera you know and it feels it'll, it's only 14 ounces like it feels it feels it feels plasticky it is plasticky uh as they get older these get a little sticky 
<laughs> but I'm telling you, if you want to see something perform, just like the big boys back in, back in that day around 2000, if you want to see something that you can walk down the street and, and just do street photography or travel photography or anything, the focus on this is lightning fast, especially with the G lenses, and the quality is amazing. So uh, there we go. Uh, uh, like, subscribe, click the bell. Stay tuned for uh, episode two, where we'll be uh, loading uh, a film in the camera, choosing a lens, uh, the, and uh, once we choose the lens, then I'll be going out and doing a bit of uh, uh, photography, and we'll announce what photog kind of photography we're going to be doing with the... Uh, this uh, Nikon N65. Uh, make sure that if you buy something like this, it's been uh, tested. Uh, but <laughs> whew, uh, I've seen results from this already. So, uh, you know, and I'm pretty sure I showed some. We went out real quick. Uh, so thank you, Mr. Patrick Hollins. This is uh, end of episode one. Overview, Nikon N65. Runs your uh, G VR lenses. It uh, also runs your AFS lenses. Um, that's about all I can tell you. Stay tuned. I'll be choosing uh, a lens to go with this and a film to go into this and the, the type of photography for episode two. We'll be loading the film also. Thank you very much.